what's up everyone welcome back to another video on the channel and i hope you enjoy today otaku sensei is going to be recommending the top 10 superpower anime with overpowered slash badass main characters if you do enjoy this video don't forget to leave a like and if you are new don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications for more upcoming top 10 videos there's also a link to otaku sensei's patreon and discord server in the description so you can further support him and without wasting any time let's start the video In 10th place comes in Kurai Phantom Memory. It is the year 2100, and on the colonized moon, a project is underway to explore new aspects of energy. Amamai Kurai is the daughter of the chief scientist on the project, and on her 12th birthday, she accompanies her father to the lab to observe the experiments. Then something goes wrong, and Kurai is struck by twin bolts of light. In the aftermath, her father is dismayed to find that his daughter is no longer his daughter. Rather, her body is now home to two energy entities with fantastic powers. In ninth place comes in Brave Ten. Isanami, a young priestess of Izumo, is forced to watch as a group of evil ninja burn her temple to the ground and slaughter the people within, leaving her no choice but to flee to the forest and escape the same fate. By chance, she stumbles upon Saizo Kitagakure, a masterless ninja from the Iga school. The two travel to Ueda Castle to ask Yukimura Sanada for help. Isanami's possession of a strange and devastating power is revealed, and Sanada readily agrees to help her, gathering ten brave warriors to Isanami's sides. Thus begins Brave Tin, a story set in the Warring States period. It follows Saizo and Isanami's journey through the war-laden lands and in search of brave warriors to serve under Yukimura's banner, each possessing powerful skills of their own. They'll have to travel far and wide, all while trying to fend off those who would chase after the dark power that she possesses to make it their own. <laughs> In 8th place comes in Tu Bian Ying Zhang Leaf. Yu is about to leave home when she suddenly enters an incredible world. Appearing in front of her is an 8 year old naked boy. Before she could even grasp the situation, she's attacked by assassins from a mafia group who were chasing the young boy. What was even more unrealistic for Yu was that the leader of this mafia was another almost naked 8 year old boy. While trying to escape from the attackers, Yu loses one of her shoes and by a strange kind of magic, her shoe turned into a warrior who was able to save her by blocking her from harm. Who are these naked kids? Why did her shoe turn into a warrior? And above all, what kind of world did the eight year old boys come from? <laughs> In 7th place comes an s.cry.ed, a strange environmental phenomenon that occurred 22 years ago in the Kanazawa prefecture caused the land to split and protrude upwards, reaching unprecedented heights, creating the secluded area known as the Lost Ground. Kazuma is a young mercenary who lives in the Lost Ground looking for any work he can find to sustain his livelihood within the harsh environment. He is one of the few people that are gifted with the Altar ability, which allows him to plaster his right arm and torso with a metallic alloy. When this mercenary encounters Holy, an order whose purpose is to suppress and capture what they call native altar users, and one of the elite members of Holy, Ruho, an epic rivalry begins. Oh, 
今日もエンジンさんがよく見える。The sixth place comes in Vivid Red Operation. Friendship is the key to protecting the world, that is everyone's wish. Here in a world where science has solved all questions, this story is set in Oshima. The happy, carefree 14 year old Akane Ishiki lived a poor but well loved life together with her reliable little sister Momo, who does all the housework, and her grandfather Kinjiro, a genius inventor who only created useless devices. When the weather is clear, they can see the artificial island named Blue Island across the sea. In the center of that island rises the revolutionary manifestation engine, a discovery that solved the world's energy problems. It is a peaceful future, just like everyone dreamed of, one where everyone can smile and be happy. But suddenly, the world is visited by danger. An unknown enemy, the Alone, appear, targeting the manifestation engine, and as none of their weapons work and they fall into despair, a lone girl takes a stand wearing a red pallet suit, which wields a great hidden power. Before long, allies gather around her to fight, and the friendship becomes the only hope for saving the world. <laughs> In fifth place comes in Terraformers. During the 21st century, humanity attempted to colonize Mars by sending two species which could endure the harsh environment of the planet to terraform it algae and cockroaches. However, they did not anticipate the species' remarkable ability to adapt. Now, in the 26th century, a lethal disease known as the alien engine virus has arrived on Earth, and the cure is suspected to be found only on Mars. The problem is, Mars in the present is overrun by creatures known as the terraformers, incredibly powerful, intelligent humanoid cockroaches that mutated from these originally sent to the planet. The NXI team, consisting of 100 men and women genetically advanced with characteristics of powerful organisms from Earth, has been sent to Mars on a mission to find the cause of the alien gene virus. To help cure humanity, signaling the start of the crew's fight for survival. In fourth place comes in Mikugura Gakuen Kimikyoko. To be around cute girls wearing cute clothes is all Erna Ichinomiya desires. Since Mikagawa High School happens to have the cutest uniforms around, she decides to enroll in this prestigious high school known for its cultural clubs. However, she does not realize that joining a club is mandatory, and representatives from each club must battle for a ranking. Based on these rankings, club members are awarded housing and food. Chasing after Seisa Mikagaru, the most beautiful girl in school, Erina joins the Going Home Club but finds herself thrust into fighting the next club battle. With the other club representatives wielding unique powers, the competition is sure to be fierce. <laughs> In third place comes in Gachiman Crowns. Hajime Ichinose's ordinary life is in for a change when a transcendent being named JJ Robinson hands her a small book called Note. A device which transforms her into one of the Gachiman, the legendary protectors of Tachikawa City, stressing that the existence of their group must remain a secret. Following Gachiman, Suganai Chichibana takes Hajime to their base of operations, where Paimon, the panda like alien leader of the Gachiman, reveals their purpose to eliminate aliens that pose a danger to humanity. These existential threats, called a mess, are becoming increasingly dangerous, destroying everything they touch. Now it's up to the Gachiman and their new recruit to stop them before the world is engulfed in chaos. In second place comes in Jaokumachi no Dandelion. The Sakurada siblings live in a normal life in a typical Japanese household. Well, that's what their father, the king, wants for them at least. 
As members of the royal family, each sibling possesses a unique ability, and over 2,000 security cameras have been placed around town to make sure the children are safe and sound. Moreover, all nine of them have been designated as a potential successor to the throne, with a decision that the next ruler will be selected through an election. However, for the timid Akane Sakurada, the third eldest daughter who wields the power to manipulate gravity, all of this attention is a complete nightmare. With all the cameras constantly monitoring the candidates and even broadcasting their actions on the Sakurada detected news channels, she decides that if she becomes king, the cameras have got to go. But just how will she convince the public that she was the most suited to rule if she can't even overcome her own shyness? Election season is in full swing as the search for the next king begins in Jakumachi no Dandelion. <laughs> In first place comes an armed blue gunvolt. In the near future, there are people with special power called Sevens. It seems like the country has maintained peace by a company called Sumeragi Group, but they are the one who captured the people with the special power by force and did inhumane experiments. Gunvolt, the main character who has the power of Sevens, used to be in Feather, a resistant group who fought against the Sumeragi Group. The story begins with meeting the heroine Sien. Alright everyone, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And remember to hit the notification button for more upcoming videos. I'll see you guys next time on a brand new video. Peace out. Have a splendid day.